Well, I've made my parallelogram and uh, well, I should be working today actually, but um, I said sold it to myself. And these are my little celestrons, which are covered in dust now. <laughs> and they made this parallelogram, like I say. Um, I've used a Linhoff ball joint head here, which has got a nice fluid swirl on it. And just a little bracket, you know, up and down. Um, oh, my arm's long enough. I've, ha I've got to wax the, um, the joints here, but it's, it's reasonably smooth on there. And then it obviously rotates. Oh. <laughs> Things I need to do, I would say, well, unless you can think of anything that you can see that I need to do. One is, I've sort of like um, had this cheap old rubbishy tripod laying about, and it's not man enough, which is that thing there. So I need to make a tripod for that, I think. Um, it's a bit wobbly. You know, if I put in, see that it's a bit of play in that, to say the least. <laughs> it's no good. I'll construct something for that. I'll find a decent tripod. Oh, there goes my compressor. Do, 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 do. But, um, and oh, oh, the other thing I think I need to do is this bearing in here is it's a little bit too fluid, I mean, it's a bit free. So I'm going to create a little friction, adjustable friction, just underneath here. Um, maybe a bit of Teflon or something, but I can uh, adjust up and down that create a bit of resist resistance on this. Um, well, that's my idea anyway. So anyway, there, that's my parallelogram. Bit, bit tweaking and it should be hopefully be okay but I can't test it because it's cloudy and raining so that's about right isn't it